Hello everybody, uh, today is day three, lesson three, and uh, as you can see I'm wearing my lab coat, I, I forgot to like um, keep it like in the corner. Um, I'm a little sick today, and no I don't, I'm not here for sympathy. The only thing that I want to share is that I just realized that um, once you get sick, it kind of transmits to others and it kind of infects others and you're contagious and um, you kind of infect people around you. This is what happens in real life. Sometimes what, ha what happens is you have some inbuilt memories or things that you have embedded because you had a negative experience in life and that kind of builds that anim that hostility towards other and you become hostile and you become you have grudges against people and you kind of transmit that and that's how you become infectious that's how you become sick and you spread sickness in 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 this atmosphere in this world and Sometimes when you get infected with with this negative behavior, you transmit it to the people around you because they may consider it as something wrong, but in a way they get affected too. Like being unfair to somebody, you kind of stop it. But in a way, if your mind is weak or if you have similar childhood experiences, you learn from it. So make sure whatever you show to the other person or show to the rest of the world it's not infectious it's not contaminating people it's not polluting people and it's not spread like that uh, we learn from experiences we learn from negative experiences we learn from good experiences as well but sometimes we catch that coldness not the cold with the flu but the coldness of people so make sure you don't get infected, you don't get sick. The only sickness you can have, God forbid, is just a simple flu, which goes away. So make sure whatever you choose in life, whatever you learn from the actions of people, you get cured of it easily, happily, and for a limited time. All the best. This is me signing off. Do well once again. Thank you for having me.